now we have received not the spirit of the world, but the spirit who is from God. How many glad you've received the spirit from God? Watch this. That we might know the things that have been freely given to us by God. That we might know. Come on, Jack. That we might know. We'll say it one more time. We have received not the spirit of the world, but the spirit who is from God, the helper. That we might know. That we might know. That we might know. That we might know. The things that are freely given to us by God. You say, well, why are you, why are you saying that and repeating that so many times? Because I'm, I, I want to communicate to some people that have been trained that the Holy Spirit has been sent so that we might feel. But he's been sent so that we might know. And if you just think of the Holy Spirit as feelings, come on, we, we've got songs all about feelings. And there's nothing wrong with feeling. Thank God I do feel him. Thank God he touches me. He's encountered me. I've encountered him. I have an experience with him that is, is better felt than told. I'll tell you that. So I thank God for that. But come on, how many know when you're in the fight of your life, you need more than a feeling? That's awesome. But that moment doesn't always manifest. And you've got to be able to say, I know that I know that I know that I know that I know. Yes. Acts chapter 3, we won't turn there, but in Acts chapter 3, the first 10 verses tells that beautiful story. Peter and John going up to the gate, beautiful, the timely gate. And when they get there, they see that man over 40 years old. He's laid down there to beg. And Peter's, John stop, and the Holy Spirit moves on them. This is right after Pentecost, right after the infilling of the Holy Spirit, the baptism. And Peter says, look on us. And the man looks expecting to receive from them. And then Peter says, silver and gold have I none. And the man has to change his expectation. He's expecting money. But Peter says, silver and gold I don't have. But watch these words. But what I do have. I give to you. Mm, how did he know he had what it took to get that lame man healed? Because he had received the helper and the teacher living inside him said, you've got it, son. Now you can give it away. I wish somebody would help me praise God. Come on. How many like to live in such a way where you know what you've got? 